start. We got our first start today and the bike sounds really really good great idle a very smooth off of idle all the way to according to my ear tack about 3500 rpm i think we revved it for a while we got the strobe light out we had the strobe light out so we strobe checked the ignition it was just about dead nuts on so close that we're leaving it there and um it looks good it's all dressed out. We're waiting for the brakes and um, brake springs. I've already replaced the brake, excuse me, the wheel bearings. Just waiting on the brakes and brake springs. And the drain 
plug for the transmission because this one is all gnarled and messy and I'm determined to take it out so we can put a new one in there. So, well, just because. Neatness counts. Um, we've done a lot to this bike and um, I'm really happy with it. All new electronics, a battery system, ign electronic ignition, uh, solid state rectifier charging system, a cute little muffler that uh, I think is adorable. Uh, by the way, it doesn't stick out any farther than the Monster 2 two mufflers. There used to be a Y here and they'd come out and there were two Monster chrome mufflers that stuck out on this original um, B B50MX. And they were um, really impressive, but so so ugly. They were the first thing that was ever taken off these racing bikes. And uh, this little stubby is going to be just fine. Thank you very much. Uh, when we did start it, you may have noticed smoke. That's from all the residual oil of our hands having been all over the exhaust system, back into here. And uh, that, that cleared up nicely before the, um, the test was over. And just gonna do a slow walk around. I love this tail light, it looks really good. The rear fender is painted black. That looks really good for being a rattle can. We ran the sump vent out to the back end of the bike where it's safer than in front of the in front of the wheel. I've never liked that. This is the solid state um, electrical rectifier regulator. It's there. This is your fuse compartment. Right now, since we were working on the bike, we always take the fuse out when we're working on the bike. Always take the fuse out when working on the bike. Never work on the bike, no matter what you're doing, with the fuse in place. It's a good place. That's a really good way to turn your bike into a spark generator. So we always pull the plug out when we're working on anything on the bike other than getting ready to start it. Uh, it looks good. Um, I'm real happy with it. So, coming all the way around, we've got a uh, new electrical system, and uh, I'm going to call it good. We're waiting on the brakes, like I say, we'll get that done, and I'm not sure I'll do a road test on it or not. May just make sure all the gears work. Um, still got the old tires, and uh, we'll, we'll see about maybe up and down the street as a road test just to make sure the gears work. All right. And uh, that is the way it is, and the fun just never stops. Isn't that cool?